Good morning! Today is May 21st, aka Concert Day. I'm going to see Coldplay. It's my first time seeing them, so I'm really excited. And I have to travel all the way up to Coimbra, which is like two or three hours away, I'm not sure. I'm getting ready right now, I have to be really quick, but I wanted to come say hi and start the vlog. It's my first concert vlog, which I'm really excited about because I'm going to a lot of concerts this year, so hopefully more concert vlogs throughout the entire summer. I have this cute makeup look idea that I've never tried before since they're all about colors because they have those bracelets that light up during the show I thought it'd be really funny to do a colorful makeup look that's why the outfit's a bit basic but I'll show you the outfit in a second right now let's get ready and let's talk a little bit so they are doing four shows in Portugal I was only able to get tickets to the last day which I'm not mad about because I think once an artist does like multiple shows it's always fun to go to either the first day or the last day i mean all shows are good are great i'm sure but i don't know i feel like going to the last one or the first one is always cool i got tickets to the last day because it was the only day i was able to get tickets to it was really hard probably one of the hardest shows to get tickets to that like i've ever tried to get tickets to i am going to the show with my mom which is really cool because Growing up, I always wanted to go to every single concert ever and she would always come with me. So I feel really lucky that I get to go with her to see a band that she really likes. Not that I don't like them because I do like Coldplay, but I would say they're not someone that I listen to like every single day, even though I do like them a lot. But they feel really nostalgic to me because growing up I listened to them a lot and my history teacher in middle school, he would always play Coldplay in class. So. I don't know, I have this feeling of nostalgia, so I think I'm gonna have a lot of fun. And I'm also really excited about the opening act because they have Bárbara Bandeira, who is a Portuguese act. I was about to say actress, who is a Portuguese artist. I have never been to one of her shows, but I have seen her perform live, like here and there, and I run into her a lot. We we'll probably live close to each other. I'm not sure. I think it's a really cool opportunity for her because she's really young and like her voice is really good. So I'm really excited to see her. I'm really happy for her. And I definitely have my favorites that I want to hear live. The second opening act is Griff, who I'm super excited about because I only found out about Griff last year. She was the opener for Dua Lipa's Future Nostalgia Tour and so I saw her at Dua's tour and I really liked her and I'm happy that I get to see her again because she's really fun. She's like, I don't know, she just has a lot of energy and her songs are really catchy. I'm really excited about that. As well. Another cool thing is that I have a few friends who live close by the stadium and they're not going to the show but we're gonna try and meet up so that we can like actually meet because we're friends but we're like online friends we've never met in real life so we're going to try and meet up so we can say hi and I have another online friend who is actually going to the show and I'm also trying to meet up with her but I'm not sure about the details like i don't know how it's going to happen but we'll try to make it work and now i'm going to finish the makeup look I'm going to do something to my hair and i'll be back and i'll show the finished look hi so i just finished getting ready i did one braid on each side of the hair and here's the finished look i tried to do like splotches of color like someone is trying to paint with all of the colors from the album. I thought it'd be a cool idea. I don't know, I like how it turned out. Maybe I'll film a tutorial for TikTok. And I'm happy to be back with the creative makeup looks. This is the fit for today. Just a simple white top with a denim skirt. It's actually shorts, which is perfect for a concert. And then some Converse with the white socks. I think it's pretty cute, it's simple. I wanted something simple because the makeup is already so colorful but yeah i really like it and now i'm going to get some food and then i'm on my way to Coimbra. so we're currently like almost in Coimbra. i believe i think we're like 30 minutes away it's been one hour and 30 minutes inside a car all i've been doing is watching the new season of selling sunset i am just tired but the new season is pretty entertaining so i think i'm doing okay now i'm about to go back to the car and go to the 
a 30 minute drive and then I'm hoping to see my friends before I get in line so I'll check out the video then. Okay, I'm here, but there are so many people, it's going to be impossible to find my friends anywhere. I have no idea what I'm going to do, but yeah, it's also starting to rain quite a bit. There's so many people, look at this. It's insane. Oh, you probably can't see because of the rain, but yeah, I'll report back soon. into the venue and it was so like weird outside it was way too many people and I wouldn't say it's like super super organized but we're here I'm inside so at least that's good and I'm excited for the start I am super super tired from being outside and I was really hungry but I just had some food and I also met one of my online friends from Twitter and a boy she was super super nice I was really happy that I got to meet her and especially because I don't know what I would have done so many hours waiting outside for the show. So now I'm here and I'm gonna try to show you the venue but I'm a bit scared and anxious to film and to talk to the camera when there's a lot of people everywhere. But yeah, I'll try to show you inside and I'm just I'm just ready for the opening act to start. I can't wait. I'm going to the show with my mom. Bye.
Dumnezeu a creat siduși.
So I'll give my thoughts on another day. Overall, it was really fun. I had fun. Did you have fun? Yes. She said it was the best show she's ever been to. Yes, it was. I, I can agree with that to a degree. I think the show is like really well put together. However, like Dua Lipa will always be one of my favorite shows ever. Because she is Dua Lipa, like she's one of my favorite artists, but it was a really good show. Like, I love all the light. That was my favorite yes. part. But yeah, now we have a two hour road trip ahead of us. And I'm tired, so I'll film more another day because I want to talk a bit more about the show. And yeah, that's it. Bye. Bye. So it's been a few days since the show, and I just now realized that I never filmed an outro for this video because I got home at 3 a.m. after the show and I was feeling really tired. But anyways, I did want to say that the show was really, really cool. I had lots of fun and I think it was one of those shows that doesn't even feel like a concert. It feels like an experience, you know, like overall the experience was amazing. Like I love the set list, the opening acts, the lights, like everything combined was so amazing that it was a great experience. I loved it. I think it was amazing and I'm really glad that I went to the show and every time I looked at my mother she was like having so much fun so that was really cute too. But yeah I think that's gonna be it for today's video. If you like concerts I am going to a lot more this year. I'm going to see Sabrina Carpenter, The Driver Era, Machine Gun Kelly, Harry Styles, Five Seconds of Summer and Blink-182 and I plan on vlogging all of those shows for my YouTube channel and for my other social media accounts so please make sure you subscribe and consider checking out the links for my other social medias like Twitter and Instagram and TikTok and all of those so yeah that's gonna be it for today thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next time bye